having this be a film that doesn't shy away from the issue of abortion, was that ever in something that came up in financing the film and you know, even as you've been promoting the film and having it out, has that ever been a problem or in any way? Well, that's where the half a million buck budget came into play. <laughs> You know, honestly, because you know these are not actors who would, you know, uh, there's just, you know it doesn't matter whether the actor is in a hundred million dollar movie or, or a very low budget movie. This is um, the same actor. Um, uh, no, I, I I don't think so. I mean, you know, we were we were conscious of it. You're always making decisions, and um, in a way, if it's politicized, you're always going to make somebody angry. You know, um, uh, and at the same time, I I liked. Uh, we, we, we talked a heck of a lot about it. The main thing that we did was, uh, I talked to Lily about if any part of this movie seemed fake to her, of the script before we shot, so. And uh, Lily, did any part of the script seem fake to you before you started? No, no it didn't. Um, no, nothing seemed fake. Because I it's so interesting that this is a movie with the issue of abortion in it, but yet in so many ways that's not, like the only, th this movie is not necessarily like an abortion movie. It's about many other things as well. And was it difficult in just structuring it to have it, to get that, that sense of it? That it's a movie that has this in it, but that's not the only thing that it's about. I mean, that was just sort of the, f the framework. I mean, there's, there's various isms or issues in it, whether it be ageism or uh, gender uh, or, in, or, or sexual orientation or, or abortion. Um, and uh, I do think that um, I, I just tried to keep blinders on it a certain way. Um, and to, to try to get things straight in terms of when they do end up at that clinic. Uh, 